Fish and other aquatic life may be harmed by ammonia, a toxic chemical. To guarantee a healthy environment for your aquatic pets, it is crucial to frequently check the ammonia levels in your aquarium. There are several visual indicators that can tell whether your aquarium has high ammonia levels, despite the fact that test kits are frequently used to evaluate ammonia levels. One of the first signs of high ammonia levels in an aquarium is fish gasping for oxygen at the water's surface. Fish may have trouble breathing when ammonia levels are high since it is a respiratory irritant. When your fish frequently surface to breathe, it can be a sign that your aquarium's ammonia levels are too high. High ammonia levels may also be indicated by stressed fish. Fish may swim erratically, dash about the aquarium, or brush up against the items in there. This is due to the fact that ammonia can distress and irritate their skin and gills. High ammonia levels in your aquarium may be indicated by strange behavior in your fish. Cloudy or foul-smelling water is another visual indicator of high ammonia levels. Your aquarium's water may become milky or murky from ammonia, and it may also smell strongly foul. If the water in your aquarium seems hazy or smells bad, there may be too much ammonia present. Unfortunately, in extreme circumstances, elevated ammonia levels can cause fish to die or become critically ill. Toxic ammonia levels may be to blame if you discover dead fish in your aquarium or sea fish that appear lethargic, floating at the water's surface, or laying at the bottom of the tank. If you believe that your aquarium has high ammonia levels based on the visual indicators we've mentioned, it's critical to act quickly to fix the problem and prevent further injury to your fish. Performing a partial water change is one of the best strategies to lower ammonia levels. You can lessen the concentration of ammonia by adding new, dechlorinated water to part of the aquarium. You can also apply a biological ammonia neutralizer or conditioner. These products contain helpful bacteria that transform poisonous ammonia into less hazardous forms, such nitrite and nitrate, which the aquarium's nitrogen cycle can then break down. For the correct dosage and application, according to the manufacturer's recommendation, keep in mind that keeping good water quality is essential for the survival and well-being of the animals that inhabit your aquarium. These visual signals might help you determine whether your aquarium has high ammonia levels even though test kits are the most accurate way to assess ammonia levels. If you observe any of these indicators, as quickly as possible, action must be taken to reduce ammonia levels. You might do a partial water change, add an ammonia neutralizing solution, or tweak your feeding and cleaning schedule to do this. Of course, utilizing a test kit is the most precise approach to gauge the ammonia levels in your aquarium. However, by observing these indicators, you can determine whether or not your aquarium has high ammonia levels.